I welcome you. I welcome you back to Circuits 2020, the final hybrid event today, uh, Saturday, 24th of October, and we're very pleased to have Rebecca, also known as Hearts Beating in Time. Rebecca, thank you first of all for coming for our final hybrid event, um, live event. Um, I thank also all the public that's present here. I would like to remind that this year Electronic Music Malta is supported by the Arts Council and that this circuit's 2020 edition is again, once again, supported by Spazio Creative and the German Multi Circuit through the Greta Institute. And we are here with a nice live setup from, from Rebecca. Um, first and foremost, Rebecca. Welcome um, to, to Circuits. Um, I know you've been following us and attending our events quite, quite, uh, I'd say, busily. Um, so, um, first and foremost, how, how did you start uh, your interest in electronic music? Um, actually, before, um, when I was about 12, I started out as a drummer, um, and I was always, always in bands um, in Malta through that time, up until about three years ago when I was with this band and we sp um, split up. And I decided I wanted to do it um, alone because I didn't want to be in a band anymore. And um, it kind of naturally took me towards um, electronic music because I like the idea of being able to make everything yourself. And that's mostly how it's got started. So it's, it's the independence thing that mainly, yes, mainly exactly. gave you this um, inspiration. Um, how would you describe your own music? Um, I guess it's more of like a kind of dreamy, um, dreamy electronic, um, a bit pop sometimes maybe, but with like maybe um, not so um, jumpy, but a bit more sad, <laughs> I guess, that kind <laughs> okay. of thing. Well, that's quite a, a long description, <laughs> exactly. but anyway, aren't we all in the same world? <laughs> um, can you describe a bit the setup you have here? Okay, so um, actually, the, I think the most important part is um, my DAW, and I use Ableton. Um, before I use GarageBand, and then um, I moved on to Ableton because it's better to use live, um, I found. Um, I have just a very simple MIDI keyboard um, for me to just, you know, put some, some notes in. And that was always the setup that I had, and I just have playback through the computer. Um, recently, I added the Volca drum, um, just to have a bit more textures to the sound. And um, I have the TD3, um, but I'm still getting a bit used to it. So, And everything goes through the sound card. Um, it's a very simple setup, actually. And then I have this controller for the volumes um, in case of mixing issues or if I want to mute something. Really. And what can we expect in your life today? Some new um, stuff, possibly? Yes, yeah, so um, I have some new songs. Um, so I have some songs from the first album and some from the second. Um, I'll also be playing a single that's going to be released next week on the 30th of October with a video. And so it's kind of a mix of, of both albums. So, okay, so thank you very much, Rebecca. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you. Meeting in time. Thank you.
like to welcome Sam on stage, please. Also known as Princess Wonderful. Okay. So he's a good friend.
for coming. And um, thank you, Iamman, for having me today. Thank you, Sam, for joining on stage. Thank you to the people on the internet watching us. And yeah, that's it from me. Uh, control is coming up next.